there comes a point in your life when you need to break out of what you're used to. It was cool to see like the different types of healing in the bones. I think this opportunity allows you to see how medicine is practiced in developing countries. Then they put a nail and try to get compression as far as possible at the fracture. So he's kind of just giving us an overview of like, you know, when you put in a nail, when you put in a plate. Yes, very cool. Just then. learned it right now. <laughs>The Ultimate Med Internship, or the UMI, is a program of Youth Futures International. It's a, a wonderful program for college students across the United States to gain valuable insight into what a career in medicine is going to be like for them. Our college students come to us through the National Society of Collegiate Scholars, which uh, is for freshmen and sophomores that are exceptional students. Of course, you know, the college students that are attending the program are all undergraduate students or pre-medical students and the type of exposure we provide during the OMI is something that they really won't get until medical college. Uh, in the US you don't get this opportunity to go visit all the different specialties without saying okay I need to shout out this doctor, I need to shout out this doctor. Um, you have to like go through an extensive like application process. It's really competitive but here and um, you get one shot and you go to all of these different specialties. The students get a wonderful uh, look at the various specialties, the uh, various departments. We've got students who see general surgeries, we go through uh, orthopedics, pediatrics, general medicine, oncology. Basically they get a, a very good overview of the various departments and specialties in, in medicine. I've shadowed before, but the, the level of interaction I've had over the past two weeks doesn't compare at all. So yeah, this is definitely a, a unique experience. You know, most students who come through the college UMI, they want to go into one of the more traditional practices. But every now and then we get a student who wants to focus on something like psychiatry. And what's nice about the UMI is that, you know, we do have some flexibility in terms of kind of finding uh, opportunities for students that are kind of a little off the beaten path. My name is Eric. Uh, I'm from Stony Brook University in New York. Um, I'm originally from Japan and I definitely want to get into psychiatry. Each individual has their own unique story, history that you know they want to share and they want to tell and that they have and some of these patients with mental illnesses, they're afraid that their story is gonna end bad, that it's actually never gonna end, or that it's gonna get worse and worse and worse and there's no healing. And that's where I wanna come in and help them out. And you know, if possible, have them you know, have a good ending, or if not a better ending than what they had. So that's why I wanna get into psychiatry. Our first college UMI actually had mostly uh, pre-med students, but uh, it's also a fantastic opportunity for anyone who wants to pursue a career in any healthcare, you know, career. My name is Allison Jett. I go to Old Dominion University. I'm currently studying nursing. The nurses work side by side with doctors all day, every single day. So you might as well get used to the terminology, the, you know, process, the, um, like, relationship that you have with the doctor. So you might as well get used to it now. I would say absolutely go on this trip. You know, whether you're the doctor or you're the nurse, you get to see things that you will never, ever see. I don't think that you could have this experience in the United States. I think that one thing that's really important is studying abroad and seeing what else is out there in the world. Hello, Harley Barlow. It's good to meet you. So everyone, this is Dr. Barlow. He's the medical superintendent of nice to see you. the Civil Hospital. Um, I guess the highlight of this trip for me was going to the rural areas where like field workers from the hospital, like doctors, um, would go out to rural areas where they, they can't really 
transport from their homes to the hospital. And I, I feel like that was really, um, it was really different for, for me because I, I don't think I'd ever experienced that in the U.S. So. I was really hesitant coming in, just a little nervous about all of the culture. But I think that this is an opportunity that not a lot of people get to take advantage of and I'm glad that I did because even if we do get an opportunity to work in the hospital in the U.S., you don't get the culture part of it and um, I think that, I hope that I took enough advantage of it while I was here um, because it was definitely interesting. And um, I really like seeing the oncology department. If you're interested in the medical field and you're not sure what field in medicine you want to go into, then I'd recommend this program because it, 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 it helped me decide. I think the most like real world experience for me was like going into the emergency room and uh, <clears throat> seeing the patients come in in agony and pain, but seeing the doctors like keep their composure and like uh, help them out and treat them. So yeah, I think that's that's my highlight. <laughs> I enjoyed the way your Physicians here handled your patient load despite the ratio of patients to doctors because it, it didn't seem like they sacrificed compassion for efficiency. They have less chance of getting And my best experience was in the labor room we saw two live births and I thought that was I've never seen it in person. It was it was something, yes. <laughs> so. Thank Definitely this trip was a little bit nerve-wracking because I came in wanting to be a physician's assistant and now this trip has definitely made me want to go to medical college. This just got me so much more excited. Just like seeing it, you know, hands-on and experiencing it up close, it's just been amazing. It was definitely worth it coming here. It would be terrible to go into medical school, pay all that and then realize I don't like this. So it was definitely worth it coming here first, getting a look at everything, and being like, yes, this is what I want to do.